I am working with Sony Vegas Pro 13. I need to send a project to someone down the street. It doesn't matter if they're out of the country. But I need to be able to package it up so they can edit it. This is the proper way to do that as you cannot send a Vegas file and expect someone to open it if they do not have the project files. Let's say this is my project. It's a very small example project. This is just scraps that I have that I was editing uh, that are extra pieces. Let's go ahead and delete those. Now we just have the project left. If I click at the top, it should just highlight the project only because there's nothing else in the timeline. Let's go up to Project Media. This is all the pieces that were in your timeline to begin with. Click on the lightning button. It now just erased everything else that was over here and just left what you absolutely need for the project. As a side note, it will not copy applications that the other party does not have. So if you're using a plugin like New Blue and the other party does not have New Blue, it will not be able to be opened on their side because they don't have that application. Go up to File, Save As. I'm going to go into my Documents and I have a project folder here I created. There's nothing in this folder at the time. I'm just going to name this Test. And I would click Save, except for that will do nothing but create a Vegas file. So Copy Media with Project. Click on that. Save it. Copy Source Media would copy the entire video clip of each video clip. So if this is a two minute video clip, it'll copy the whole thing. But I pretty much have this trimmed the way I want to. So I'm going to create, create trimmed copies of media source with two seconds on both tail and head. Okay. It's telling me that the timeline, some of the project media was not trimmed because it will preserve the quality. Fine. Okay. X out of this. If I go back into my documents, back into that project, I now have, I now have only the stuff that I need to open up that project. So if I click on my test, I now have the project exactly as I had saved it. X out of that. I need to send this now. So I'm going to right click, go down to send to, compressed zip top folder. It's now making a zip top folder. As long as all of the project media you have in the folder is under two gig, you can compress it into a zip top folder. Here's my zip top folder. I can now send that to anyone I want on Google Documents. They can then download it and open it up as if they were sitting in your studio. And that is the proper way to send a project.